here, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode here on Pastiche of Skin. It's an absolute pleasure to have you. Thank you very much for coming back and joining us again. We got more Marvel Heroes Omega for you. It is a free play Friday, and this is a bit of a bonus one because Venom just got added to the game. I want to play as Venom so goddamn bad. Really, really bad. Um, I'm not a big fan of Spidey in Marvel Heroes Omega, but I want somebody who's a bit tankier, a bit more powerful with the same power set, and Venom is the one who's going to give it to us. X going to give it to ya. Well, Venom going to give it to ya. So obviously they've got multiple costume sets here. They've got um, Spire, the symbiote Venom, and then the other one next to it is Anti Venom, which was uh, I think uh, Eddie Brock wore it for a while, but it was actually a cop that wore it before him. But um, it's an alternate symbiote costume. The big thing is that um, this is early enough to the point where it's still not available on the EU stores to buy with cash, but you can pick it up as a character for G's. So you can buy G's and then you can buy the character. Uh, the package is a little... I don't know if the package is that much different. Well, let's see what the... We have to, we have to read the biog on this one first before we start. Though he started as a reporter for the Daily Globe. Daily Globe? I thought he was a Bugle reporter as well. Eddie Brock's life took a drastic turn when he was overtaken by an alien symbiote, which was previously bonded with Peter Parker himself. Calling himself Venom. But Eddie had one purpose. Destroy Spider-Man at any cost for costing him his job. Having become content with not obliterating Spider-Man, Venom has since served on the side of the Angels from time to time, calling himself a lethal protector, and enacting his own twisted brand of justice on those he deems even more twisted than he. Look at that character model. Look at the sheen. Look at, look at that tight ass. God damn. Um, yeah, Venom's looking pretty fucking badass. <laughs> I'm looking forward to this. So what's in the offer? Um, 2000 G's. Uh, available only through September 27th, so instantly unlock Venom, one bonus costume, two Marvel's loot boxes, two experience boosts, and uh, no G's, because if you bought it uh, with real cash, you got the G's on top of that as well, but you spend the G's to get it. Uh, bundle includes playable Venom, uh, uh, one bonus costume received, Venom's anti-Venom costume, guaranteed, <laughs> guaranteed, two Marvel's loot boxes, and two XP boosts. So yeah, let's, let's, let's do this. Boop! Boop! Oh yeah, baby! Hero unlocked. Let's open that shit up now. So, mm, I'm going to open the Marvel's loot boxes to start off with. I'm going to open one. And if there's good gear in it, I might not open the other one, but we'll see. Ten Marvel's Essence. Four Marvel's Essence. A shitty as fuck credit chest. A shield supply boost and a fucking matrix of... Unbinding. I'm gonna say there's good uh, armor and stuff inside this. It's a uh, it's a marvelous loot crate. Marvelous loot crates don't have armor. I need to open a shield supply box because I said you look at the shield supply boost right there. Why did I open that? I didn't know. There was no need for me to. There was no reason for me to open that goddamn box. That just offended me. It just, <clears throat> Every single time I have to get myself annoyed about this. So uh, yeah, we can jump out here and jump straight into playing as Venom. Uh, I'm gonna grab the deliveries from this here as well. Three ball. And grab here, change character, and let's get ourselves on to Venom. I don't. So are we going anti-Venom or are we going ordinary Venom? The tongue, the tongue has me. Like he's blinking away, he's fine, but Venom is the one of choice. The darkness consumes. Consumes. Ah, <laughs> nice, 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 nice. Well, I am... Uh, I always drop my things at a time because I want to be able to hit faster. So attack speed goes speed, 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 speed. Oh, 25. And we're going to get three speed up. But uh, attack speed by percentage. And I'll save my infinities for just a little while. We'll get our synergies in first here. So what are we going to need? Ah, this, is, this is going to be the problem. We're going to have to actually look at powers and get ourselves figured it out. Legal protector, uh, movement and claw. We've got claw and webbing. So Wolverine's going to actually be useful for him. I don't actually use anything but we are Venom. Uh, melee webbing, melee, melee. Webbing, webbing, melee, webbing, melee. Hicker? Ooh, a ranged hicker. Rare enough one to see. Ranged, melee, melee. So... Most of it's melee, webbing, and melee, webbing, and claw. So keep that in mind. Melee, webbing, and claw. Whenever I actually picking out of these, 
and we'll we'll get into the rest of this stuff whenever we kind of get more involved. But uh, melee weapon and claw, melee weapon and claw. All right, let's uh, filter. Do we actually have? I can't filter by using sixty, but we'll take sixties. Um, melee and range, bam! That one's definitely going in. Uh, increase attack speed, health and hit, always going to be useful. Uh, damage versus normals, elites, always a benefit. Although. I really do need to get him up to 50 so I can get the extra melee damage from him as well. And bonus versus boss is always going to be a benefit. Uh, the key, uh, no. Melee and melee. Boom. And second melee, no. Health and regeneration, yes. Damage versus bosses, yes. Dodge multiplier, since that's by two. And claws. Boom. That, that looks like a pretty reasonable bonus stack right there. I mean, it's not as healthy. I mean, if I threw Hulk on, that'd be like 10, that's 10% 10 extra health to start off with. But I'm hoping that Venom's going to be reasonably stacky, strengthy on his own without having to actually have all that added on. And he'll be dodgy too because of being the spider sense and stuff. So uh, I'm okay with this. We can jump on in and get ourselves rocking and rolling. So that everything we need. I'm tempted to actually do do this every single time. But I'm just wondering, am I wasting my points? How do you how do you respend points? Just been remember, you need to respend points if you actually put a point back. Then yes. Okay, so you can just respend them anytime you want. That's grand. So um, I'm just gonna go and spend them all on that because <laughs> that's a habit that I have where I throw it in about six or seven percent of attack speed. Uh, the boost at the start because I I want my I want to be able to hit more rather than actually hit hard uh, because I assume the character if the character hits hard as is that's just a ban that's just a bonus <laughs> so powers assigned uh yep so that's our dodge got a dash oh is that a dashing sponge as well no, no. is this is like movement escape is actually pretty uh, effective for combat as well works for me oh do you know what I need to do I need to drop anything that's in my pockets uh whoa. I don't storage. Nothing in storage. Uh, weird. Well, yeah, we'll put you into storage because we don't want anything Spider-Man related in his hands. That'd be a good idea. Oh, that's right, because I have actually been, I wiped everything out of my pockets, didn't I? Huh. It cannot be used by Venom. Be used by Venom. So, uh, those are going to all, we'll put all those into storage just for now. Get them out of the way. Um, I think there's literally nothing here for him. Right, well, what I will do is I'm going to grab a legendary for Venom to start with because I've got uh, enough points to drop it into. I so, we'll, we'll start win. ourselves off on a good foot so that whenever he does unlock a bunch of stuff. Um, that one's really nice. Not anything particularly for webbing. Uh, we got one, we got an ultimate one for Spidey that might actually apply really well for this. See, we'll go down the bottom of this and work away from here. Um, brutal Where damage, was brutal justice damage. when they shot Hulk into space? Um, Where was Red Man? Powers, powers, Think of our power together. Powers, defense. And stealth. Shield. Perseus. Melee powers. Movement powers. Brutal damage rating. We had to leave the enemy mortally wounded. Jesus. Twice per second, 8,000 twice per second. Pretty impressive. Uh, reading the bleeding powers. Gonna bleed out people. Norn stones, channeled. Uh, summoned alley health, Neptune. Green fire. Biomass health, no. Move speed. Eh. Health. Force, down to the range. Down to the sword, no. Energy damage. Uh, I think I'm thinking I'm just literally gonna to have to go with something that's just for pure violence. Yeah. It's the one that makes most sense to me. Because the rest don't really really fit most. I mean the rest of them are actually kinda of like a mixture. Fourth has no ultimate powers. Jesus. I know it's not a Jacks of Aries just for flat out damage. And um, we'll throw that on him. And that'll be our starting point for a legendary weapon. Um, I'm not too concerned about 
making sure that I actually got the best thing for him, but we'll make it work. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, there is one here. I'm gonna throw another couple of these on top. Just to get the, get the stacks going. And. <laughs> we might actually use it to get this thing off. So let's get ourselves started up. First mission with Venom. To Hell's Kitchen, I say. Let's make this quick. Let us rock and no roll. So we need to get ourselves as fast as possible up to level ten, because then you're actually like you're making progress. They tell me you might be ten, you can actually run. Once you can run, it'll be fun. I'm looking forward to actually having Venom versus Venom fight though. What the hell happened to my dash attack? Looks like enemies have become allies. Kill the first one I see. my dash on the wrong key for some reason it's actually set to the left rather than the right for some reason Very weird like normally it defaults to the uh circle button hey level two ah uh, no we actually have more than one i need to reset map up because that's going to drive me around the band dashing with the wrong button it's, it just feels wrong it feels like that that's not the button i dash with and that'll be it. Some of this dash, is dash doesn't always throw him forward because the way it works. That's annoying. That is very fucking annoying. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He's, just, he's just spraying his fire mass everywhere. Before you say anything, Deadpool, shut up. <laughs> Before you say anything, shut up. That's always a rule of thumb for Deadpool. Come on, let's make some movement. That's pretty, I do like having a big spray attack. That's nice. That's a room clear right there. Not without more energy. Well, that's level three. This is only the beginning. Only the beginning. I'm waiting for him to do that. We our enemies will fall. I love the fact he's got wearable claws. Um, moss and beyond con medallion. Oh, look at the Might as well give him a flourish. Fireman logo, just to piss him off. He hates it. <laughs> ah, nice. How's it going, guys, in the chat? Spider ham, spider pam. You know what I really should have done? Should have marked this as actually being Marvel Heroes Omega as well. Because all the people would be able to find it rather than being a web show. But, uh, hindsight is 20, 20. I don't want to really want to stop do that. I mean, I'd rather don't before we have web show. But in that case, people might be able to find it otherwise. Post it around in all the forums. Post it around in Marvel Heroes. Somebody will find it. Ow. <laughs> How do you look like a perfect like hell? That pretty wine ring. Delicious. Treatment. Get out of my way. Let me show you real power. Won't be calling me small time anymore. So it, it seems to be actually a pretty regular amount of attacks there. Oh, there we go. More 
Uh, you're dying already. Uh, uh. This is like the. I've never really thought of Venom being about ultimate power. It's like it, the dialogue lines seem off for the character. Why is he not talking about eating people's brains? That's what the most important thing is. He's like, crack your skull open and lick out your brain. Our enemies won't like this. Almost there. Just boom! That's all we needed. With that. Fantastic. Just keep swinging. Just fuck you. Just keep swinging. Just keep swinging. Just keep swinging. Looking forward to a error match. <laughs> it died before he even touched the ground. be a hurting venom as well. This is like the logic that gets dropped whenever they do these things in games. Special attacks and I actually am with just flat out punching the guy. So I'm gonna just start doing that for a while. Level 14 already. We're rocking it out with a venom. Let's see how long it takes before we get up. We're at about level 15 now. Ah! Oh. Only stopping for it. Mind if I cut a piece of that symbiote off? I have some ideas. What I should probably do is think about doing the um, trial now, just for the extra year. Maybe at 15? But do you, think, do you guys think it'd be possible to actually pull off? Venom, he does use he uses a fair amount of like trappy and uh, multiple hit and multiple enemies in a single place kind of web uh, attacks. He's got those web ones, so he might. Good. But we'll see uh, if we see whenever we get past this. After shot there. After the shocker, she was never the same again. Oh. 
said, leads only. And nothing that's not anything that's not rare. Not even ah, oh, sweet supply box. That's our first supply. That's going to be our first interesting gear, I imagine. Do that right after shock. We'll be like, what, level 20 by the time we open it? I'm not getting this whole power trip thing that Venom's on. I'm still not getting it. I'm just gonna like, Venom wasn't about power, was he? He's about revenge more than anything else. Revenge on everyone. You want my job? No, that's not what I want. I want you to die. Yeah, time to shake this place down. Yeah, it's time to run. <laughs> that's what it is, Shocker. It's time to run. It's just that it's always time to run. I thought it was going to be fancy by that, but no, just get done. Yay, more powers! Okay, so we actually have got our spots to fill up now. Uh, we've actually unlocked our amount of ones and I haven't even moved on with them. Alright, so we've got our dash, uh, predatory web. Does it actually make some vulnerable to damage and it does one single hit of damage? Not a big fan of that, don't really care about it. Um, Hard and ball of webbing. Yeah, it's uh, too slow though of attack. I like the big web bully, the big spread. Counts a slow, 2,000 uh, thousand per second. Uh, wrap the prey up, head to go, stop them in the tracks, stop by your webbing. It does damage twice per second, three seconds. Okay, no escape. I actually could be on board with. And this position here. Ah, crap. Um, shouldn't really be doing character stuff while I'm not in. Essentially, you know, like a base. So I'm, I'm meant to go into the trials now anyway, so. Wait. Oh, it yeah, makes sense. I'll finish the chapter. I'll just do as far as um, Doc Ock as I normally would. And then I'll actually jump into the trial right after Doc Ock because I'll be back at the base. So that makes sense. Well, it does mean I'll actually, unless I see yellows. Oh. This job's gonna kill me. Yeah, I like that it's an individual strike that actually does uh, constriction and a uh, number, like a couple of uh, other bits of damage. So that might work. Nice. Uh, what I really need is actually one of those uh, artifacts that was like the uh, Spidey's one, where I'm setting people on fire on my webs. That fire webs. Oh, like I turn myself into the fire ant man. Speed death to you. Not without more energy. Yeah, I don't like the fact that the energy cost, the web cost is so high. That makes it less effective. You only get about what four shots of it. To death. Like, I can go toe to toe and just stand there and I'll do more damage. Come here. There you go. Uh, understanding symbiotic bond. I like that. I think it's one of the things. My symbiote actually has read a book about it. It's how to actually treat your partner better. Your meddling ends now. No, my meddling just begins. Take this! Oh, shut up. Your interference annoys me. How many of you spiders must I squash?
But like the web that I hit him with actually killed him after he fucking jumped into the air. I was like, oh, I'm pissing. Oh, I'm hurting. Oh, I'm hurting. Oh, I'm hurting. Oh, I'm hurting my leg. Greetings. 22 by the time we even finish. By Doc Ock, I'm on level 20. God damn, dude. That's fucked up. Okay, so we'll go up to the tower now and we'll actually work from here. That way I'm not going to lose any of the time that I have for um, leveling from my EXP bonuses. Just thought I'd mention the fact that you Let's may move see ourselves a, a little bit out of the way. You around here. That's a big part of why we're after the tablet. Right. Something uh, seems to be yes, playing jump right. rope with Restart. the fabric of reality. Got the best thing we got. That's the best thing we got. We'll we got arms and all nice the balance. Is that a shredded maw? Or shielded maw? I was gonna like shredded? It was like, it's so fucking metal. <laughs> but it's so fucking buff, I suppose. Or anything else. Uh, ooh, that actually might work. Uh, complete relic of Asgard, so good for him. The only other one that I actually have there. Uh, I am using a lot of webbing, though. Same for my range bars. More biomass would be down helpful, too. Let's give it a try with the Relic of Xandar, see what the difference is. And then I might try the Relic of, like, the stack of Relics, but they're actually easier. Like, I mean, switch them back and forth, they're not going to be full, but, uh, good job. Oh, that's right, we have a shield supply drop as well. Boom! Let's try that. <clears throat> Before we go to the store and trade everything off. All right, so shield supply drop number one for Venom. Give us something good, give it. Quick Strike Claws, Durability, Symbiotic Bond of Brutality, Exhilarating Icar. Ambusher Organic Webbing, Deflecting Maw, Cosmic Spirit, Wondergore Play, Relic of Atlantis, Mudok Medallion, and a Shield Spray Print. Uh, that's, that's not bad. That's like, that you like. That looks like it covered everything. Yeah, everything's got a proper upgrade, and that'll be perfect for going in and doing this uh, trial now. No, it did not. But that'll be useful. Yeah, I mean, that'll be more damage. Written, but I, just, I need that. I'm probably going to need the health at this level. Good. Something actually awesome to grab. And, ooh, quick. I think i great on that. What medallions can we use? Oh, Guardian. Anyway. Uh, magic, power, no, we don't. Psychic power, no, we don't. Psychic. Melee power, eh, well, that's good work. Um, power, four. When you use a hand to hand power, gain 69 health per second. I think we may be worthwhile getting that because of uh, the bonus for the webbing attack as well, so keep it as is. Uh, 35 movement speed for pricing when you use your med kit. Plus 3 energy, gain a damage shield equal to 30% of your health. Boom. Um, stop your enemy's attack, take 10% less damage from their damage type for 15 seconds. Oh, that's actually a pretty good one. Think of the power we can wield the together. Summoner Raptor? <laughs> always, always love this. <laughs> If I get the Summoner Raptor, it's a good day that day. Uh, I think we'll just get this. But yeah, that's a good start. Um, we're gonna go and do a trial. Well, we'll talk to... Hello, hero. Kirk first. Yeah, essentially gonna give me a level for nothing. This is only the beginning. Well, let's see how we deal with the base level heroic trial. With the level of weapons, the skills we got. I haven't even I haven't even changed the default skills. I'm literally just playing with the ones that are defaulted in, so let's see how they go. And we might have to change it up.
Not like the fact that I'm running out of uh, dodges too quickly. Oh, get out of the way! Helping you that much, Mandarin, to be actually getting after me. This cannot <laughs> be. Uh, that was actually kind of satisfying, to be honest. We sense the threat. <laughs> But this claw attack is actually very, very shallow. So that wasn't too I difficult at all, really. Um, the red skull shall always no point was I really massively challenged with losing too much health. He feels so much more stand-up-ish in combat than Spider-Man. It's similar powers in a lot of ways, but just stands his ground, which is great, and actually has a fair number of knockbacks. And that's all with the default. You know, that was easy enough to do with just the defaults. I haven't even looked at the, uh, uh, the, the cooler skills that he might actually have. Let's see what we got here to actually, like, Mix this up a little bit. Um, raising record, rinse up a ch chunk of terrain, smash it into debris, and pelt foes or rain of wreckage. So, oh, that's pretty big. Eight second cooldown, though. Smash and slam the ground, barbaric fury using your symbiotic strength to wreak havoc around you. So, we, oh, we, this is, she, he's got a, a She Hulk style attack. We are so fucking using that. Um, that is going to be my replacement AoE post burst. Uh, snare your enemies in your webs like a spider to the fly and drag them towards you, kicking and screaming. Nice. So that's it. That's essentially how I pull them together. And one was here. Oh, base damage plus 50% health gain. Wow. Whoa. For once, we don't want to grind your bones, Parker. Yes. That's just like, no matter what, it's critical hit chance, base damage up. The buff for 8 seconds with a 30 second cooldown, though. And see, there has to be. I'm on about this talent that'll actually reduce that down. That, that, that's what that sounds like a most common thing we'll be doing with it. I think it's up there before plunging back down to the ground with a forceful crash landing, so that's a big slam attack. Tendril <clears throat> surge forward to your start, start point, getting enemies on their path, so that's a straight shot attack for passing through enemies. Which might be more useful than the blast that actually knocks back. Curious. Hmm. 
Sinister smash, slug your enemies while a symbiote smack down as he lunge towards them to deliver the final knockout blow. Um, uh, so it's actually it's plus one percent damage per per one percent of target passing health. Uh, like a killing blow essentially. Rain toss, tear up the yeah. Uh, the rain toss is actually already there, and I've already got it on. So I'm using it at the moment. Um, wrap your party up, head toe, stop skipping. I think that's going to be my build for the moment. But, well, actually, be honest, I want to get rid of that. I want to get rid of Crowder's web, so. I'm, so, maybe replace Crowder's web with impaling those in your path. It only does extra damage, though. Oh, a nice slam attack. That would actually be nice. I like that. Or have a slam in there rather than actually. It's, a, it's good to actually have like the thumb, 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 and that'll give that leap me in, so I can actually do more damage. So I leap in. So I have a leap in, and then I can actually have mine leap in. <laughs> I haven't heard mine leap in in a long while. Mine leap in, and then. A Ground pound. Um, does that use any biomass to do? Uh, yeah, biomass boss. So maybe what I need to do is actually think about um, increasing my biomass count. That's really what my materials need to be put me towards. Mm. Makes sense. Right. So on to the next mission. We'd love to. And this time with a uh, not with feeling, but with a uh, correct level. Of difficulty. Boom. <clears throat> we'll do, sir, do heroic for a little while, see how our build works, and then we might go back and get super heroic done if, it, if it's easy enough to do, just for the speed of actually leveling. A lot of beasts and stuff on this map. Ooh. Kind of like, I want to see those more because I want to actually see how I like, get a chance to fight some groups. Yeah, it's a very slow version of her ground pound because um, she holds one, picks up pace as you actually do it for longer because her rage builds. Needs to be improved and increased. Yeah, are we going with the anti venom costumes? Bloody heroes. Stupid heroes. Haha, <laughs> dumb hero. Try to see my throat a little bit because I'm actually starting to growl a well lot with the dead voice. God, just give me to the cops already. Just give me to the cops already. I can't handle this. Let's see if I can just grab them with this one skill. Yeah, it really does. I, I mean, AOE attacks like that are so goddamn good in this game because if you can if you can sniff it out, you can actually just take the health and you're the more guys are around you, the more damage you're doing, the more you're gonna be wiped out. Oh, it works it works for me and it worked for me whenever it's playing the shield. I think Venom's going to be a lot of fun because of that. Although, um, you don't have that kind of like ranged, uh, destructive capabilities of, say, of Scarlet Witch, where you just can wipe out everything in the goddamn room. But, uh, oh, it's hurt you. It doesn't matter how many guys are around you, you just do more damage and more people are standing there looking at you. No more. No more. I can't take it. Hey, 
Oh, it's Black Panther. I was wondering there. I was like looking at the character, going like, "Who the fuck character model is that?" I do love my little raptor. Uh, raptor bro, no! Starting to get sick on here in the the power delicious power thing. Um, yeah, Venom's lines are not great in this game at all. Where's that Eddie Brock charm? Oh, what have we got? Nothing massively worthwhile. And something worthwhile. Nothing else for worthwhile. Oh shit, we got rings. Uh, we don't have any rings to actually put on. But we do have a Spider Man. And I'm thinking I might throw Rhino on because it's always, always useful to have someone that'll actually knock people down for two seconds. You need to dash away and you can take somebody out with your dash attack to hold them down for two seconds while you're recharging uh, ammo. Damn good. Level 28 already as well before we get to the food, which is good pace. So we get into the talents in four more levels. First talent, we'll take a look to see what we can get. Well, hello there, scientists. Oh, sweet. Weapon for what the other does. That's a very short range too. Uh, 
Glorious leaders will always be displeased by your lack of success. His web spray is pretty damn white, too. Swingy, swingy, avoid all the fights. Anything we don't want to do, we just avoid the fights. Keep on swinging and we don't want to run away. Oh, that was first talent fairly soon pretty sure we get i'm pretty sure we can max this out by the time we get the fisk that's like that's that's what our rule of thumb is by the time we get the fisk we should be funny like after hood i think we'll go for super heroic because we're we're about the right we're about ready for super heroic i think well a couple of tweaks in the skill set that i have we can actually do a lot of damage Symbiote. Jesus, so many lawn rares. Really hate it whenever I have to do this individually. Actually, not even fit for his character. The rest of them are actually kind of cool. Yeah, right. Uh, 
Ugh. Rings, nothing else. Good. Moving on up, I'm moving on out. Time to get ready. Nothing can stop me. Nothing but just pounding on a single room for, or single space for anyway. And is there there's one down here, is there a other room? Yeah there is. Yeah, there was. Probably beer. Quick and easy one. gain of that is actually pretty damn high <laughs> although admittedly the gain for health recovery whenever i do like drop in health is kind of important too we'll see how the damage works if i can kill him faster than we can his heart Cosmic Cosmic one was actually pretty good. Hit the game tense first, very useful. Moving on. Oh shit. Okay. Full again already? Jesus! Punch, 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 punch,
don't think I need a green katana. Maybe the hell's left long three. Yeah. Better do it in here anyway, it's safer. No, we don't need a class mouse grandfather. I think I'll be fine for five. Uh there. For start. Get the fuck out of there, Wolverine. No more green. Don't even pick up green. Don't even look at them. Don't eat them. That's good. Reason attack speed's always going to be useful, but. No, I actually like that defense as well. Yeah, that's, the, that, that's still gonna be the better one. Even with the extra health, uh, the damage reduction doesn't get it. Too much more. Too much more. All the more needs to go. strength and then put the speed up on it it is pretty damn vicious. What, three, six, Who are doing you guys? Six hits per second at about three thousand. We got synergies ourselves now, but pretty forgot about that. Um, we'll set the talent first. So, when you use a symbiote strike, encase your hands in hardened webs, adding a biomass cost to increase the down by 30%. See, that's the problem. I, I'm we're always running a biomass as it is. Symbiote strike turns into hungry and strike. Vicious rush turns into tended lunge. Hungry and strike and tender lunge restore percentage you're missing health on hit. Yes! Uh, constricted webbing transforms into. Rising tendrils, rising tendrils cost health instead of biomass, deals more damage, and fires covers a, a fire covers a wider area. Three projectiles per activation. Web volley transforms into devouring tendrils. Oh. Will you be staying? Okay. Interesting. So willing to tree it off your life for a benefit? You sure about that? Oh, nice. Plus 5% damage and below 50% health? Jesus. Okay. So that's probably going to replace... I don't know who Venom's going to replace, actually. 
Claws actually down useful. Don't put bosses that give me a boost off whenever fighting these bricks. Um full six percent melee. Ten percent rolls and elite. So it does this a three percent bonus in general, but we tend to take that out. Yeah. Oh no, fuck that. Angela, we don't need you at all. And... Nobody else is looking particularly get ridable. Need the health, anyway. Alright, that works for me. Oh, we've unlocked all the rest of the powers, too. So, uh, constricted webbing, trap your adversary and devious web. Not only, not only six of the bit, but presses and tight over time. So, three seconds of immobilized, eight seconds of weaken, and. It doesn't say how long. Is it three? They're only like a thousand per second during immobilize. Demolishing slam! Web the ground before yanking the train straight up from below and slamming it back down in your pose. Nice! Um, I may swap that out of the R. Raising wreckage. Hit the 13. Hit the 13. Go down. Hit. 9 to 13. Go down. Hit. Yeah. That's good for this. And my signature moves and be it spiked. They're now enemy brain and burst of tendrils dragging them into your waiting array of hard and big spike. Boom! 35. Uh, as much as that bonus is actually nice, I want to know what it, if there's anything that can reduce its cooldown time so it can be used like constantly. And punts. Punts are just. Uh, I'm, I'm okay with good I think they're actually cool, but. I'm not gonna them. And. That's our build now, I suppose. That's some, that's some mild changes. Great for us. Long range strike, tendril lunge. We're gonna kill me up. Uh, web boy, my. Because that I need to get rid of, so I need to put something up. Or tendril and feel? I feel like they have tendril and feel actually. Flat out damage and about 10 to 15. Although, what do I do that weakens? Try this with the layout, and um, we'll try that with uh, fight. <laughs> this venom's all just hanging out up here because we're like, we ain't got much else to do, man. We're just killing everything. Yeah, we're just killing everything. fair bit compared to what it was previously but it does heal me now so hmm that's what my trade-off was As long as I can actually go through the as long as they don't cause the cause strike me and shit, I'm actually going to be fine.
Yeah, the health gain from that is actually pretty... pretty cool. It feels so gratifying to actually just hammer through this. But um, I am stopping fighting every people that you've run into. I'm not thinking to use it as much as I would whenever I depend on signatures for other people because it doesn't seem to actually be that destructive. So I imagine it's pretty good whenever you have a large group of people who are like, whoop, all together all and then you right. start Looks like class is in session. Tell me what you think of this. Watch and learn. Almost beat Thor with this one. Spikes be on one dude. <laughs> Shiny trinkets. So maybe this is actually time to start. Uh I don't mean Venom. This is actually my first time playing as Venom. He's uh he only came out today on PS4. So literally it's uh, my first opportunity to play as him. So I'm kind of uh I'm kind of finding finding my feet with his skill sets. I'm liking so far his actual grinding point. Reminds me a lot of She-Hulk, but with some of these Iron Man moves and built in. And um, I'm actually liking the fact that he is, he is properly kind of like he's a good toe-to-toe -to -toe fighter. He can he can stand there and just pummel, and he's doing good damage. But um, I really want to figure out how I can max that out. I mean, I've got his brain set, so it's actually doing a little bit more damage. It's good for on the spray. But whenever I get into a crowded room, nothing beats the. Uh, the that's just not fast enough, that's the problem. Because uh, she hold her is unbelievably fast, and actually, like, it's shocking how fast she gets whenever she gets into the just really good for it. And that spray is so wide! So wide! Don't tell the boss I sucked. How dare you punch my raptor. Venom versus raptor. Neener, neener, neener. We can't carry more can't this carry more shit. time. Perpetually getting rid of shit out of my pockets. Forever and a day. Just trade them in, we don't need 
to like having pockets full. Whenever I literally had nothing in my pockets otherwise. Game yeah, is just full of bad no. <laughs> You need some be a punch floor. <laughs> oh, punch floor. It came in. <coughs> Excuse me. Green shit though. No more green. Get eaten my green. is going to go if I keep doing that kind of like Riley Venom voice, so I may not do it at all for the rest of the night. Oh, I've been oh, looking God, forward to this. Laryngitis! Surprise! Son of a bitch. Why is the hood is actually gotten harder to beat lately? I've only noticed this in the last like couple of whenever I started playing with I was playing with um Spider-Man and I think I was what was I who was I running? Spider-Man and somebody else are running and I actually think I fought Hood like three times back and back. And each time he was just more of a dickhole with all the teleporting and then actually have his his attacks actually being enough to chip damage you down very quickly rather than actually being one shotting. Alright, let's put ourselves down here. Get off some shit. Empty out our pockets. Please don't handle the supplies. Oh, wait, no. That's you don't need Stark Tech when you've Doesn't got guess I ever end up prestige, or was it Omega Prestige? Somebody else in, in the future. Oh, 
all that stuff goes in there. And whoop, all that stuff goes in there. And whoop, uh, I can handle the heat, Ghost. So you don't worry me one bit. What? Oh, the box? Oh, man. Storage is full again? I suppose it's filled with all bits and pieces now, but um, that means that we're going to have to actually open these. Whoopsie doodles. Oh, oh, that's actually useful. So, um, oh shit, we're running out of currency boost, so I might actually give that a upgrade here. Um, currency, 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 currency combination. No. Oh, am I short on currency boosts? Yeah. Huh? Combination experience. Well, let's take out. Uh... No, I don't want to leave two of those in. Uh, there we go. Use, use, back out again. Um, use, use. Symbols, hero, symbols, storage, all of them. And then we'll go. Right, so we're going to open a couple of boxes now. We're going to open a marble suit box, and then we're going to open uh, two sealed spike drops, just because I don't have the space for them in the storage, and I just think it might be useful to get someone out of them. I'll only do one sealed supply box, now I'll do an all one later. So, marble suit box, anything of interest? Four marvelous essence, a credit chest that's garbage, enhanced genome, ten cosmic fragments, and a large character experience open for Deadpool. Eh, eh, there. So, we got that along the way here. Which one is it? Ten externity splinters, cosmic fragment, unstable molecules, cosmic essence, relic of Wakanda, omega essence, a pair of gloves, a bodysuit, a eaker, a uh, organic rubbing, a pig mall, a new cosmic spirit, pen shrinking serum, I do like pen shrinking serum, Hulkbuster munitions, deflection ring, relic of Xandor, a crossbones medallion. Ooh, ooh, nice. If you use explosives, that'd be really good with rocket, actually. Let's see, uh, Cosmic Spirit. When you hit enemy with power gain 5 Spirit, you're going 25% of your health up to 3,000 and 100 of biomass. You get 25% of your health by default. Using your signature power gain 1,000 damage for a thousand when, you hit, when you hit to gain 10 Spirit. Um... I think I actually prefer the one that I already have on, to be honest. Crossbones not gonna be any helpful to me. Rhino. There's a better Rhino one there that I'm already wearing than the one I'm wearing, so. Yeah, take that. Maybe get to this one. Your anger is vast and unchecked, but consider focus as um, an alternative. Andor, I think we got the extra five of those. I'm already using it. And. Yep, the rest of this is here. Nope, not improved. Boom, that's improved. Lots of damage difference. A lot of health gone. Gain damage shield worth that. Within 10 seconds when you pick up any orb. Oh man. Would complete us. Yeah. Yeah. Well, uh, it's damage range for range powers. I think it's the range. No, it's just bosses. I'll do more damage with my melees, but we'll see how this crack goes. Don't throw the right here. No. It was lying to me. Lying to me! That's good. That one's actually an um, improvement of all sorts. And that one has this too. Sweet. A ring on this. Gotta put a ring on this finger! That's a good deflection ring. What if I them particles? Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. It's not a brilliant Pim Trinkin theorem, one to be honest. There's actually our better ones. I might throw it in as my third whenever it unlocks, but as it is now, I've got two pretty decent ones sitting there. That stuff. That crack. Put some of this stuff in storage. Get that in the pockets. You want blend or puree? Do you even want to hear okay, it? Okay, I want to open it. Just because I can. Okay, I'm feeling 
flipping because I've got like 20 of them and sitting in storage. Um, I was looking hoping for another, another uh, cosmic item. Cosmic shockwave. That's not too bad. Oh. Nice. Do we summon squirrels to help? Boom. Grammas. Bonus. Well below 30% health. I really hate being down that low in health though. Oh, no, I like the Ultron spray. It looks pretty cute. That was a garbage uh, box again. I'd say I, I just did it out of reflex and I really shouldn't have. I should have, like, oh, get onto that one. Except for later. Might have actually been better for another character. Different time, a different place. Because the is pretty good. Uh, when you hit, unleash. 25% when you hit. Unleash a kind of shock wave, knocking down enemies in front of you. Nice! So every f every four hits, I'll knock them down? 10%? Dip. Damn right! So the fact that I'm actually getting another 10% of my attack speed as well. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna take them a summon. And anything that's actually gonna be a summon over the top of whatever I've got currently is always gonna happen. Uh, max die. Oh, that one's actually a full bonus. Oh, it's exactly the same. The only thing I'm missing is the damage shield. Hmm. Can't be one that actually is going to be generally always better. It's not gonna affect mine. Next explosive power gains. So it's just a fucking massive bonus to brutal strike. And now onto the talents. Would you like some real power? So symbiotic spikes transform to we are everywhere. We are everywhere causes you to fade from view, striking enemies without giving them the chance to fight back. We are Venom grants invisibility while the buff is active. Nice. Oh, we are Venom lasts two seconds less. I fuck off. That's. I wanted to actually could reduce the cooldown. 100% of your maximum health regenerates 100% of your maximum health and biomass when you are defeated. Okay. You just literally you just can't die. We are unstoppable. Uh, boom. Pray for us transforms to come. Let's give transform into an effect. Effect costs health lasts longer, but does not immobilize and spawns the symbiote spawn. Ooh, okay. So no escape actually makes four of your guys. So any of these I am actually using. Like the only one I'm actually really using is We Are Everywhere. Ah! Early enough, some dogs bites. Kid, you better learn to keep your mouth shut. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna use We Are Everywhere instead because I'm not a big fan of the uh, pull everybody into one single space kind of move. You know, I, prefer, I do like my like disappear and being vulnerable for a few seconds, kind of like a uh, respite. Especially if you get the chance to heal during it. Let's make this quick. That's one less Parker we need to worry about. One less Parker? Mm. I'll take you where you need to go. Oh, because it's uh, grand, maybe? That'd be the reason why it's one less Parker.
think you're making progress. Oh, no, she's staring at you, dude. Yes, I can. Launch the boy over the bar and they became inside out boy. will never be destroyed? Uh, give us time. Oh, wait, one more guy. There you go. Damn, I always found it. I seriously closed my eyes at one point there and I thought I'd fallen asleep for too long. That's terrible. <laughs> I'm literally losing the progress from whatever I'm doing in the game. Alright. <clears throat> 47. 13 levels ago. 13 levels ago. No! Should do. 
property. Look here with speedwise. Uh, impossible. Uh. Every single one of these is usually a level, so I'm going to grab this one. Does anyone I can get along the way will actually be worthwhile, I suppose. <clears throat> Plus, possibility to build it. zoning out while I'm actually playing this um it's, it's the fact that I, I think I'm I think it's one of those things where I think I'm actually not finding the actual gameplay of Venom that intriguing I think that's what the problem is but that is exactly what happens whenever you arrive as She-Hulk and it's like it was fine I was just glad to be on another character because she does have that kind of like step in stand still Kill everything. Step in, stand still, kill everything. A few seconds to like slash, 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 slash. Especially with this uh, bleeding or like the healing bleed kind of uh, attack on us. It's a, uh, that is actually a, that is actually a healing boost. It's awful that my brain is just being out on uh, 1 to 66 or 1 to level 1 to level 16 video. It's just about fun. Here's on it because how easy it is that kind of. That cheap, well, it said you didn't cheat this. Fall honor? Good. Fall on your own grave. Oh, Gorgon. Is that actually useful? Actually, yeah. I suppose locking people in the face and then making them vulnerable. Well, yeah, I'm actually liking this. I might, I might be using this instead of Rhino because I've got a ring that actually gives me the knockdown effect anyway without having to do the pass by.
Continuing on in our quest, 1 to 60. We've completely lost all sense of conversation. We have nothing else left to talk about. We have already made every joke possible uh, by slithery tongued venom. And we're actually just kind of trying to trawl out that last 13 levels. Um, I'm trying to think what's the best way to do so. I mean, doing the story missions is probably the best bet. You know what, actually, super heroic, that's why. We can do super heroic at this point. Then we will uh, speed up our EXP team. Because yeah, I can feel the card, I uh, feel the level is actually like slowing down now. And we're well enough leveled that we can probably take some heroes for the first half all. Unless it's property skill, but I'm like, screw. Nice. I might do the job. Um, I think there's a teleport pad here. Yeah, whenever we're on the beach. No, we're past the beach. This. Hi. That's uh, my report. Let's go. Trials. Let's try a super heroic trial. Let's see if we can survive this lunacy. I'm feeling like I'm not doing as much damage as I used to. So, curious to know. Did not handle that in any way, shape, or form. That was awful. That needs to die. that needs to be rebalanced. Not rebalanced, but I need to actually rethink my techniques. I mean, fuck two talents and I'm even fucked one. Uh, Tender lunge applies stealth. Uh, three seconds. Sinister smash deals deals 150% more damage while in stealth. Nice. For 55% of your max health or biomass per second. Okay, that's I'm liking that. We are venom applies gold green healing from all. Okay. Hmm, so everything I do now heals? Damn! Hmm. Tendril and Peel costs health and deals additional damage. Big fan of that. So maybe this might be worth putting We Are Venom back in again into the rotation, which I, I can definitely see. We are Venom instantly resets the cooldown of your other non-signature powers and grants 5 percent cooldown. Yes? God damn, that's useful. Demolishing... Oh, shit, what's happened? Oh. Because, uh, the one minute before you actually get knocked out of the room. That's fine. Um... Yeah, it's fine. Need to go back into it again. Right. We are Venom and so we set cooldown about everything except for your signature. Demolishing Slam, raising wreckage and terrain deal on 50% board and always deliver a critical hit. 
Since your smash turns into deadly maw, dark descent transforms into hungry maw. Deadly and hungry are powerful transformation that to deal additional damage, cause health to use, and restore large amounts of health to defeat enemies. Um, I think we are cunning. What I want to go with. So we need to bring um, and we got our synergy up to fifty. So that's it. Max, uh, that's it filled in now as well. Bring, bring just to show it. 50% health, plus 5% damage at below 50% health, so below 50% health. We, we said you want our character to just sit at 50% health, or just below it at all times then. Um, right, I need to rethink what attacks we're using here, because I'm really not doing enough damage as it was. And um, that is going to be going back into the rotation here. I don't think I need that spike. The spike's not doing enough damage to make it worth my while. Demolishing Slam... Yeah, I'm not sure about that actually. Uh, fist slam to the floor, the healing strikes, the web barrage, and what are we using? We're using that, aren't we? Dark descent. Hmm. Hmm. I think that might be the change up that we needed just oh, to get look. a boost of damage. It's an Avenger. We're saved. Because whenever I'm using it, it'll be so much more useful. Yeah. That works for me. We're gonna have to give that long try. So, they'll be right back onto the saddle. That was, I really did not feel like I was actually doing anywhere near as much damage as I was previously. So, maybe I might need to actually recalibrate my equipment as well. What we're thinking, maybe. This is a big boost there. No. Take a look at the couple of these that are actually at the top for health. 4% chance of hit. Yeah. That might be worthwhile. Yeah. Uh, I too much. I need to move speed anyway. Yeah, there's that. Really beat that. Oh, yes, yeah, sweet. We've got a third artifact slot as well. So, uh, Pim's. Hmm. Think of actually anything that would make it worthwhile. I'm gonna give the Hulk Buster a try because I'm thinking that with the webbing, it's a three inch power, and if I can actually get the knockdown on it, it would be quite nice. And we're gonna have to go for a complete pack. Oh my god, it is actually just ridiculous. Very bottom pick one. But, um, that was the range powers. You know, if I could actually have one. It's going to damage the range as well. Mm. Anyway, other catalysts, nothing there. Spot. Rhino. <laughs> we can probably move off him now. Yeah. I'm going to go with. We're gonna give it a try. I don't want to see. So I'm not too sure about this dashing through things anymore. Yeah. This is gonna be giving us a try now. Oh, it's giving. I ruined my chances actually with us because I sat in the time. I am such an idiot.
Did I just like, get knocked out of my super suit? God damn it. Jesus was going to be the case. Uh, so yeah, we're going to be avoiding the Super Heroic Trial for a while now. Um, I thought I was actually, I just don't have a build for him that actually feels comfortable for that Super Heroic Trial. I wish I'd done it earlier actually now, whenever I think about it, with uh, the setup that I'd done previously. I think I've, I think I've actually, I had a better run or a better setup for Venom earlier on today, but now I've actually got one that's, like, I've got a one that doesn't feel like it's uh, dropping DPS fast enough, it doesn't seem to be able to recover quickly enough. It's, it's not satisfying in any way, shape, or form. Ah, damn it! Totally made the mistake of actually going to the wrong one. I am properly can I think my brain's just starting to shut down at this point for some, some bizarre apparent reason. I don't maybe just not enough sugar or whatever else, but I'm not uh, compass mentis enough to actually be doing this properly. That's not a good sign. Ten more levels, though. That's all we got. Ten more levels. Get to our ultimate and then move the fuck on. Killing the things, things, keep on killing the things as a lethal protector. Good at just slashing things down one to one, but it's not effective enough. Just like pulling teeth to kind of get things to die. What did I do wrong? I must have I've done something with my, the bell that I had earlier on. It felt so much faster. Yeah. 
heavy enough as it is. Feel right, but it's still, uh, still, of course, there's numbers are right. But I don't know. Uh, I'm just not feeling. But I need to get. Moving on now. Moving so, on now. This is one of those shield hideouts we have heard so much about. Together, we be the stuff of. I'm really not digging Phantom's voice lines in this. I like, I do like a whole whispery kind of like mixed voice Phantom, but it's, it's like intent of all those lines just seem so contrite and coarse. Well, middle you don't think, like, what does Venom really want? Come up here to join me, guys? Feel free to do so. Found the retreat! And this room. Extra level. thinking so many of these drop all of this motherfucking shit Guard in the deck. Chapter this next one. 
Maybe we will. Now we're on to E3. Nope. Not quite. Okay. The fist tower. We're on the fist tower and we've actually almost, almost at our, our 60. And that's kind of like it's. Oh, the hand tower. That's right. We're not fist tower. We're hand tower still. Still got plenty to go then. Well, plenty to go, but we're hopefully get it before then. trying to run. Let me end your life and we'll move on. Almost there. continue. Feels so much better. Making the start to make use of the um, webs to actually knock people down, which is kind of nice. They, I'm actually seeing an effect in enemies, which is good. It, like stops them from being able to retaliate. The only problem is, I don't know how to pull that off. Yeah.
because he's not going anywhere. Oh, that felt gratifying. So I think there's a bit of a combination kind of issue where I need to actually get the rotation right on. Because if I go for um, the giant uh, Venom, I can't, well, we are Venom, and then fight in with the uh, Brown Pound or the uh, We Are Everywhere, it works reasonably well. Actually, like that does a ready good go? wall of damage. And then it's actually survival between the charges for each one of those. Um, takes me from what, probably... 8 to 15 damage, 18 to 15,000 damage, to 25 to 30. Now boarding all. Ah, no, I don't want to go to. Why am I an idiot? And where am I meant to go? Oh yeah. He's getting, he's Let's pretend I'm impressed, then move on. Our enemies won't like this. <laughs> so where next? Is it? Yeah, it I is. Have the, the lower east side. Yeah, so we actually are going to be going for fist. We've got about four levels left to go. We'll probably hit this before Bullseye. Imagine we will. Distracting. Nice drop of uh, currently splitters there. I don't get distracted by just sitting beating on the same guys in the same spot for that entire time there. I need to go and find more elite and move on with the plot. Actually, like lose lost a lot of health really quickly there for no apparent reason. Like weakened for a wee bit after I actually done my special. Oh god, I forgot about this. 
Punching, very little going on. We can't carry more at this time. Pockets are all full as fuck. I'm really not looking forward to doing this tombstone mission. Tombstone's never fun with a character that you can actually run through everything with. It's even less fun with somebody that you have to actually do. Uh, you have to actually like stop, destroy things, move on, stop approaching, and move on. Never been happier whenever I actually had shield, but just running through all that shit. There. It's only the beginning. Two more left.
Good grief, that took forever to do. And then people were, there must be people just like counted them into me to actually like as they ran past. A fentanyl of liberty. Get off the break! I remember there being a. Oh no! <laughs> of course, it always happens. I should get to... I really need to turn that off because it's happening so often now. Whenever I'm doing the next week. So... Oh shit! Sixty in the next few minutes. I'm pretty sure I'll actually get up from fighting the boss in here, so let's go ahead and do this on the boss. You know, it's like um destroy a couple of cars. That's pretty much it. A few robots. We're gonna hit their drill though, gonna be an ass. Take him down.
Well, well, well. You think you're tough enough for Tombstone? Why do I have so much ichor? I know I'm, in, I'm the stickiest of the ickiest, the ickiest of the ore, but um, I don't need that much ichor. This should do. Hey! Done and dusted. Woo! All right, so lethal protector unleash a swarm of tendrils of terror and last reach your enemies in an unskippable assault a savage symbiote. And, uh, yep, we've got our last, uh, one of these two as well. So, Symbiosis, we are everywhere. Automatically activates we are Venom if it is not on cooldown. Right? And we are everywhere's cooldown minus five. Okay. Get an Icker meter, Icker builds whenever you spend health on powers. When full, all Icker is spent to increase the damage of your next health spending cooldown power by 300%. Jesus! Right? In a symbiotic protection meter, symbiotic protection builds whenever you spend health on fires while symbiotic protection is available. Absorbs at all incoming damage while below 60% of maximum health. That means worse for things then. I don't really like this idea of the shield. But, um, yeah, I'll give this a try. We are everywhere. Automatic activates. We are Venom. So, mm, I can, that's going to be useful if it's not, but it's like, if it is not on cooldown. So I always activate it anyway. Before, but we'll see. We'll see how this looks now. So if it doesn't give me a double dose of that, then it's completely worthless. But we'll see. Yeah, I'm, I'm not liking. It thinks it's exactly the same thing happened with Spider-Man. The talents don't feel like a comfortable build. They don't. They, they don't seem to complement or back off each other in a way that actually makes it feel like fun. We'll go up here, and we're going to use our ultimate on somebody. Go on, make it worthwhile. Give us somebody to take the hit. <laughs> Ask for this. We're going to the pet. We're going to the patrol. I get out of the way. We're going to the patrol. We'll find a boss. We'll go and drop it on a boss. That's what the plan is. Before we finish off, we've done our one to sixty. Uh, I'm going to do a shield uh, box as well. While I'm at it because that will be a bonus. Shield supply drop. Boom, durability claws, cosmic suit, strength thinker, cosmic invulnerability. Ooh, ooh, these are actually all looking quite nice, actually. Nine heads, what? When you land a critical hit, you and your allies gain 1% attack speed for six seconds. Attacks up to nine times. Damn! Uh, knock your target into there. Very, very useful. Gorgon medallion. Yeah, we already have that. Think of the power we can um, yeah, let's take a look and see what it actually means for us, boys. So we got definitely good movement there. Oh no. We literally have like one costume that was actually just as good as that. No, it's, a, it's a line menus to me. Line to me. Okay, what? I thought we got like a cosmic suit there. Oh, oh, that's fine. 
Alright, hang on. Need to do an FBO to get that stuff into my pocket. I have a few things that haven't been tested yet, but I'm sure they're fine. Uh, they're all pretty good, aren't they? Rip. Oh, why did I take some? I got rid of something that was literally exactly better, same or not be or better. I hit. Yeah, hmm. That's a, that's the sure that how my tension's dropping, Stephen. Uh. Whoa. Boom! I like the frenzy thing. Yeah, damage rate into summon power, so my little my little raptor would be more impressive. Yeah, I'm going to get a large you can't can trust jar. I don't feel guilty about getting rid of these, because at some point I'm going to get another one from playing with another character, and they don't tend to that. I hold on to those two, though. Godless, nothing was better. Right, so we're going in here, grab the rest of the stuff, read all days in here, and now we have oof to look at. No, nothing that actually was brilliant there. Oh, well, that's definitely an improvement. Movement powers have yeah, eight percent chance on use to restore one charge of your movement powers. Sweet. So every once in a while, I actually, will get an extra dash out of the way. Damn, useful during boss fights, or damn useful for, during. Oh, whoa, what? What? That's actually a pretty shitty one. Eh. Uh. Strength is up. Why is that so low? Why does it actually not consider it actually a boost? Because when damage reduction is not that bad compared to it. Health is more. Damage rating versus bosses. That's the only thing that's really the point. It's like, well, bosses will take more damage, but everything else does better damage. In particular, actually, was really impressive about that. Oh, is there a new catalyst? Yeah, great one. On the end of that, wasn't actually a great crit, but that does mean that we're actually going to go and have a little bit of a boost, I suppose, whenever we go to fight off the a boss in patrol. We're going to go to midtime patrol and fight one off and see what our special ultimate attack actually is. I don't think, um, I'm just realizing, like, I was going to say, like, have I got on the tokens for Venom, but I was like, I don't, because he literally only existed today, so then we never drop them. Well, that would have been funny if they had actually been dropping all the tokens up until this point. I really don't want to fight the Oh, I don't want, ah, oh, Black Cat'll do. Black Cat's okay. I actually don't mind fighting Black Cat. Black Cat makes it work. Oh. Hey, Black Cat. How you doing, baby? You know something? Guess what? Eat my death. Jeez, that is actually kind of a crazy looking.
on her. That's all I'm doing. She felt like a goddamn disaster of an attempt I can take her down. So yeah, I'm not feeling very confident of the build that I have of Venom, that one to 60. I would, well, I would love to take some tips from you guys, like have you got any recommendations on what to do with this? Um, like what can I do to actually improve my Venom? I want him to actually be, be able to go toe to toe, but he seems to take so long. What 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 is it I need for the damage increase? Because I mean, I, I threw on for claw powers, I threw on for melee. I even added a wee bit for range for his uh, webbing, for it's at least then actually have something that was like web knockdown. But just, what what am I what am I missing out on my build on this character? Because he doesn't feel as good as he did the first 15, 20 levels that I had him before. So, well, what do you recommend? Uh, make sure to say it in the comments below because that's going to make it so much easier for me to actually like uh, have a discussion with you guys about the character. But uh, Venom's actually looks interesting. Um, the voice acting I'm not a huge fan of. The costume difference is actually not too bad, but um, still, kind of, I, I, a lot of people said they would have preferred Toxin. I would have preferred Carnage, even as a Venom symbiote costume, or any of the symbiotes that we've ever seen before. Just something different from uh, the Venom costume, which Anti-Venom is just a color invert of, really, whenever you think about it. But it's like, the red inside the face that kind of always puts me off. Because I always wanted to assume that there's somebody inside the mask. I almost like... Um, like the old Turtles movie, whenever you saw them with their mouths open too wide, you could see the dude in the suit underneath. I want that, because that's what Eddie Brock is, he's a dude in a suit. Whenever that thing, mouth opens up the way it does, it should actually show the dude underneath, unless it actually dissolves him into it as well. But um, yeah, uh, that's actually I mean, not too bad. I enjoy playing with Venom. He is an interesting character, but um, I'm not interested in his voice lines. Uh, his build has been fun to work with since uh, the mid-levels. And I just don't, I don't, I don't know if I'm actually going to be playing him regularly in the future. So uh, if you've got any opinions, any thoughts, ways to actually make my Venom build better, then put it into the comments underneath this because I'd really appreciate it. And if you've actually enjoyed watching me play from 1 to 60 with this character, then hit the subscribe button uh, or the follow button or the like button or whatever it was that you actually found your way to this actual broadcast. But um, yeah, guys, if you actually enjoyed that. Oh, wait, if you don't do that kind of thing, make sure to just memorize the name past your skin. If you remember the name, it's easy to search for me. I'm not trying to hide. I'm easy to find. And if you happen to be watching this on YouTube, be a button up there. I'd really appreciate it that you hit. There will be a recent playlist sitting here. Over the far side will be the most recent video. And right here will be a video just for you based on the user analytics and the things you do on YouTube. 
It will pick out song that I've actually made in the past and we'll put it there for you to check out. I recommend you see that one because, yeah, you already like this. So why are you not watching it already? So uh, thank you very much, guys. It's been an absolute pleasure playing through this 1-60 to on Marvel Heroes Omega with the new character Venom. I hope you guys actually enjoyed the show as well. I know my energy levels flagged about level 40 or so, uh, but we're back. We're awake. And I want to say thank you very much for sticking with us all the way to the end. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye.